A double transfer out top to Grant Nelson. A tremendous big from North Dakota. Here's a shot off the window that falls, and Alabama takes the lead. Eight and one off that loss to Northwestern back last week, a couple of, you know, week and a half ago. And there's a three for Nelson, and that's cash. Grant Nelson has six. But so far, so good. Two catch and shoot threes, two nothing but the bottom of the net. There's a three for Lance Jones. Mark Sears, the transfer from Ohio, playing with Waggy, and now back to Sears, and that is money for Mark Sears. And I think when you're looking at Mark Sears, Aaron Estrada, th those are two perfect examples of that. Edie got the screen, little flip from Smith, and it is two and a foul. And, and making sure that he's not camping in that lane. I'll tell you what, even the on-ball defense of Estrada, there's a lob, and there is Big Maple. 25, and Purdue is trying to stop quality wins. Pull up Estrada, no dice. Did not make Nados happy. That's the shot that he is trying to get rid of with Aaron Estrada. And Purdue invites that type of shot, no doubt. There's the set, and there's Edie the plus. He just overwhelms you. You got old Zach Edie 15 away from tying Robbie for 10 down. Let's see if Alabama can take advantage. Purdue's offense not fluid the first time he went to the bench. You're going to have to find a way to score with Zach Edie out in the game. Sears driving on Gillis. He took him the whole way. Actually a fun one in game two. Smith was hemmed in. Edie back on the floor. Missed it wide. And a battle. Caleb first wins it for Purdue. I'd say first ten minutes Alabama was the champion on the offensive glass. But that's kind of shifting over to Purdue. Well, they tried to front Edie. And that was not a grand idea. And Reitzel twice off a second chance has made a three. Smith riding into the lane. Okay. It was going to be. <laughs> Wrap around pass. Estrada wants it up top. Instead, Sears whips it into the corner. Reitzel another. Caleb first went down. Has three threes in his first half. He's done it all year long. Ten of 22 coming into the day. Oh, he shot that thing with confidence. Caleb first for two. Caleb first hasn't necessarily looked for a ton of offense, but they're just a nice duck in and got to his strong left hand. Griffin, why not? He missed it for three. Rebound Lance Jones, and Purdue can tie with a three. We might hit triple digits in this ballgame. Jones and 80. This has been an adventure. Sears, another! Come on, Mark Sears! The guys with three fouls, Edie, nice help from Nelson that time, trying it loose. Well, Edie just never looked comfortable. A nice play by Nelson to crash down, now run the floor. He's leaning on Pringle, he throws it off the window hard, and here comes Nelson, Edie wanted the foul. Sears swooping in, down the wing, he scores again! And Mark Sears has been lethal so far. Sears rides it into the lane, always looking for that drive and kick, and now Lawyer knocked it away. Jones head up three on two. Lawyer, wing three. Smith, the tap, no, it dangled short. And out ahead, Sears against Edie. How about this matchup? He had it, he made a call, and boy, that is just an unbelievable move by Mark Sears. On Edie to his knees, and... He has done a little bit of everything today. Mark Sears is just a baller. And Purdue respond. Lawyer swatted away by Pringle. And Smith a great read now in a bit of a scramble. Sears to the lane. That's a goaltend anyway. It counts. First time couldn't get by Caleb first, but Mark Sears knew it was just a matter of time. That second penetration right by him and on the way to the room with that strong left hand. Oh, duck and cover. Put on your hard hat. But now Bama with numbers. Uh, the deflection that time taken by Morton at the end line. Up ahead, Jones. That was a great look from our crew there. That's why the gamble got made. Mason Gillis for the first Purdue lead today. He's got it! Nice defense down there by Heidi. Walters wants it. And that breaks the seven missed in a row for Alabama. Good pass. Hammers it. Smith 
off the screen from Edie. Smith the pull up, fading away. No good. Edie somehow could end on that, even though he was cleared out. And Tobin splashes down a three. That was all Zach Edie with a little bit off the fingertips to reset. He just wanted a little bit more. What a play by Edie. Stevenson ball thing. Edie comes to help, and that's two and a foul. Great day of college basketball this Saturday in December. That's a tough pass. Got it to Sears. Cool. And he sticks the landing. Just a simple but effective action. That is the fifth block for Alabama already today. In the first play, a lot of minutes. Now Edie backing in to hammer it home into the Purdue scoring top ten. There's people out there that say he's just good because he's big. And that, that might be the dumbest thing I've ever heard in my life. You should know he scored the exact amount of points that you did at Purdue as of right now. This, this is going to fall today. Oh, boy. Here comes Alabama. Ryland Griffin. Here we go. From the corner. Yes, sir. That's not a flare, but it's a pin. Sears three. Smith hurrying down the lane. Bouncing for Edie in the wingspan. Eats it alive. <laughs> took it. It's Braden Smith. Oh, he gave up the shot. He took earlier. And Edie closes the deal. Edie preparing to screen. It goes Smith down the lane. And Braden Smith has been unstoppable. It's just ball screen action once again. And he's done it in so many different ways. This time all the way to the basket. And a response from Sears. Rob, I don't think 84 is going to win it today. <laughs> no, it's not. Smith and Edie. Smith chucks it up. Just putting Braden Smith in a ball screen and saying, make the right play. He's done it all second half. Double screen here. He got his feet set. Oh, just missed it. First comes flying in, and the rebound for Alabama. Ryland Griffin, time ticking away. Estrada swooping in. Wraps the pass around again, two and a foul. Alabama has got good shots from the perimeter in the second half. They just haven't made them at the same clip. Now just six of them compared oh to 13 the first half. Steal for Sears, and it's a three-point game. Look at the Fox run. Alabama and Sears. One last three. That's no good. 92-86. Boilermakers, final thoughts.